In this tutorial, I will be using mod API to one shot kill enemies and to not die. The most common questions I get are, can you do this in creative mode? Yes, you can. You can do this in any mode that you want to do it in. Can you do this in multiplayer? Yes, you can. How do you make your screen so bright? Well, in the in-game settings, in the graphics tab, I go over to color grading and I select M131. I then hit Alt F3 to open up my NVIDIA filters and I choose the brightness slash contrast setting. In there, I turn the contrast to negative 100% and I turn the shadows down to negative 100%. Another question I get, why can't I pick up or find the item? Well, if you're on console, the PC is different. For example, on the PC, I can go to the yacht or I can go to the hanging cave to get the cassette player. On the console, you can only go to the yacht. Another very common question I get, why won't the cave cross off? There are three possible reasons to this. The first one, it could be a glitch. Save the game, quit the game. If you're on PC, verify the cache, load the game back up, and then very quickly go in and out of each entrance to the cave. If that does not work, you probably missed something, which is number two. You'll have to just rewatch the video Try and retrace your steps, figure out what you did wrong. Number three, you probably didn't explore the connected cave first. For example, I tried to explore baby cave while I was playing the forest one time. And while I did that, it didn't cross off. I had to explore hanging cave first, get that crossed off and then go into the baby cave, which is keep exploring hanging cave, by the way, that's what, we're, that's what I'm talking about. I had to then go back into that cave and then I could cross it off. I don't know if that's just something they knew that they threw in or what. Maybe it's a glitch, I don't know. But I'm just letting you know that there is a possibility that it is there. Cave number three, wet cave. There are two other entrances to this cave. One requires the rebreather. Here is the location for each entrance on the map. Pause the video, head to one of these entrances. The most important item in this cave is the chainsaw. The other items found in this cave are as followed. Photo Cache 7, which is located outside the walk-in entrance. Timmy's toy left arm and siblings missing newspaper. There are five passengers in this cave and they are as followed. 5A, 9D, 7C, 3D, and 4D. If you're going for the full Spelunker achievement guide, I recommend clicking the tab in the top right corner of the screen now to open up a playlist. If you have not done the first two caves, which is the dead cave and the hanging cave, if those are not crossed off, I recommend clicking the card, opening the playlist, watching those two first, make sure those two caves are crossed off, and then coming and watching this video. If you already have those two caves crossed off, continue watching the video. With all that being said, let's head right on into this cave. All right, before heading into the cave, you might wanna pick up this picture. The weapon cache picture, okay. And then uh, head on into the cave, let's go. Hell yeah. All right. Thank you for the picture, thank you. All right, once you get inside this cave, you'll be right here on the map, okay? We're going to head on towards the chainsaw, so let's just right on, run on in y'all. Okay, the little bat scare right here, thank you very much, all right. You're gonna see two passengers right here, 5A and 9D, okay. There are five passengers in here. Timmy's toy arm, right there on the ground. Okay, you wanna head from there. You wanna head to the left right here. All right, and you wanna just very quickly go in this water and then back out again, okay? So just hop on in here, all right? Do a little like, bit of exploring, whatever. Just hop on in there and then hop right back out. All right, that's gonna count towards, that counts towards exploring the cave, just so you know. There's a lot of skulls right here, all right. Okay. Head on back, go past the passengers, and then head on down this little area right here. There we go, all right. You then wanna go right right here. Okay. All righty. You wanna head into the water. Very quickly, just swim on in here. And then very quickly try and look for an air canister. All right. I don't even know if there is one in here. No, there is one in here. Just where is it? I don't know. I can't see. I cannot see the air canister. Anyway, so let's look for a foot. And once you see that foot, head on back out. 
Okay, don't stay in here too long because you'll die, obviously. I won't, but you will. All right. Head on back out. There's supposed to be an air canister down there, but I guess not. The game's just like, nah, I don't want to put this in here anymore. But I probably just missed it, all right? Once you're done that, head on over to this rope over here to the right. I'm going to jump down. You should probably either climb down or find a way down, but I'm just going to jump down. Okay. You might want to just climb down that, all right? And then in here is the chainsaw. This is where the chainsaw is on the map, right here. All right, see? That's where it is, okay? So, there's some um, rope, air, I mean gas cans, not air cans, just gas can, the chainsaw. -na 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 -na. I never actually used this, ever. I don't know why. But anyway. Flashlight, there's a passenger right here, 7C, okay? We're gonna head on over here now. Gonna go run straight across. There's gonna be, I think, five mutants, I mean five cannibals in here, not mutants. Five cannibals, there's one. Boom, dead. There's two. Boom, dead. There should be two more on this corner right here. Boom, dead. Not dead. I lied. Missed. Boom, dead. Boom, dead. Oh, get wrecked, sir. All right. And then there's another cannibal around this corner right here. Boom, dead. All right. And then there's some babies. A little babies. Just gonna slash. Just gotta crouch and slash. That's it. Just crouch and slash. Crouch and slash. All right. Inside here, there is a missing siblings picture. There we go. All right. Uh, thank you for the arrow back. We're going to head into the... Hey, 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 hey. You're supposed to be dead. Thank you. All right. going to head into this little cubby hole right here. Oh. What the hell? All right. Into this little cubby hole right here. To-do list updated. We've explored the wet cave. All right. Well, we're going to go back because I'm counting this little area over here as the wet cave as well. All right. So, what the hell was that? I thought I saw something running. All right. Heading on over here. Okay. Yeah, there's passengers over here, so don't click away from the video yet. There's two passengers that are part of the wet cave as well. They're over here. All right. Heading into the little cubby hole. Going up the rope right here. Okay. Again, I don't fly in the cave because I don't want something to happen where it causes me to glitch or the game to crash or something like that and I have to redo the whole thing all over again. So I'm good. All right. Climbing up the rope. There should be an RMZ up here, I'm pretty sure. I think. RMZ, are you here? Yes, you are. Hello, sir. Goodbye, sir. Okay, I have mods so everything dies in one hit. I'm pretty sure I mentioned that, but I actually kind of forget. Anyway. The reason why I'm counting this this entrance here as part of the wet cave is because when you come up this way from, I think, the, thank you. Thank you, Wow Hobbs. All right. <laughs> when you come up here from, I'm pretty sure the dead cave, yes, the dead cave, it gets crossed off. So because of that, I'm going to count this as the wet cave area up here. So let's just head on up here, even though I got crossed off already, but I'm counting it now. So whatever. Head on up here. Okay. There's going to be two more cannibals up here, maybe three, but I'm pretty sure it's two. There's one. Hello, sir. And here's two. Goodbye. All right. Why don't you kill those two guys? You might want to. That's the exit we're going to take. We're going to head up this way first. Okay. There is a picture in this tent, but you can't pick it up. I'm pretty sure they took it out of the game, and I'm pretty sure I know where that is. It's in the area where nobody goes on the map. Like, there's nothing over there. But anyway, so there's a picture. You can't pick it up. All right. And then there's two more passengers, 3D and 4D. There's some more uh, gas cans and stuff over here. Can't fire all that good stuff. All right. So now we are at 24 passengers. All right. All right, that is it for this cave. On the left side of the screen, you will see cave number four, which is the baby cave, AKA keep exploring hanging cave. That's what that one is. On the right side, you will see a playlist. If you need the passenger manifests, or if you need some items, or if you need to get other caves to complete your Spelunker achievements, you can click on that and watch them all in order. All right. Again, I hope this video has helped you. I'll see you in the next one. Take care and bye-bye.